Have you wondered how we want to control these three uh, different color LED by flip flopping it using a picto blocks? So in this video, we are going to learn it. It is a very simple process and let's do it. Okay, so this is the setup of the Arduino Uno breadboard, resistor and also LED color uh, red. Okay, this is green and then another one is blue. So we have uh, to connect the first one with the uh, similar ground. So this is the ground. Okay, so I'm going to change the color of the ground. Alright, and then we connect to the digital pin. So this is the digital pin number 9, followed by the digital pin number 11. And then the another one is digital pin number 12. So we are going to arrange every of this uh, wire to correspond a certain, certain uh, color uh, to the LED. Okay, so let me adjust a little bit. Alright, so the first one, so this is the blue, uh, sorry, this is the green, uh, sorry, this is the red, and then followed by the green, and then followed by the blue color of the LED. So we have uh, the connection, so the connection and also the picture and all the codes available in the de uh, description of the video. So now we are in the coding part of the Arduino Uno for the flip flop mechanism of the blinking three different LED colors. Uh, we are going to use the picto blocks open your picto blocks and then navigate your cursor into the board find your board in this case arduino uno and then proceed with the port selection of your connected usb and then go to your right uh, upper corner and then uh, change the mode into the upload mode in this mode we are going to set up our variables so the first one you go to my block over here on the left side of the uh, code palette and then followed by a make a block so we are going to make a block so the first block are going to be made named as read read led so uh, put add an input number so inside the input number over here you can type something like status so because we want to identify the status of our red color so go to your control and then choose the if diamond else okay this is the if else palette and then choose the diamond condition under the operator here go to the uh, left palette over here and then pick up one of this thing we call it as the equal signs of diamond and then we are going to navigate our status over here drag it down inside the if statement over there and then status is equal to one so we are going to teach or specify our defined variable of the red led as one and then make certain action so in this action we are going to specify set a digital pin number nine so i already connect my red color to be specified as uh, digital pin number nine as high that's mean the um, if the status is equal to one then the led are going to be light on and then i'm going to set it uh, another one at the else statement as low it's indicate that uh, the led number nine which is a red color led are going to be off then proceed with the second block so in this block i'm going to specify as green go to the add and input number same also go to status and then um, the palettes are going to be ready to be set up so to make your life much more easier you can just uh, duplicate and then uh, paste it down here but remember to change the digital pin because the green color are being connected at the digital pin number 11. So now we are going to the third LED. So the third LED go to make block also. You can specify as blue and then add an input number. You specify as status. Same also like previous um, uh, mechanism for the red and also green color. And then we define by going to the control same also you can just duplicate it but i'm just going to uh, make a repetition on this uh, use the if else statement and then followed by the operator over here and then put the diamond share operator equal sign and then drag your status inside the if status and then uh, put it as one as an indicator and then go to the arduino uno and then set digital pin over here set digital pin should be set as number 12 as high and then you can duplicate and then uh, put it under here same also digital pin number 12 but this now uh, this thing or now it's uh, already being coded as low so that the led uh, blue are going to be um, specified as uh, on and off so let us go to the main part of the arduino code you can just drag this arduino uno startup head palette and then followed by the control you can choose the forever block inside here 
and then you can insert all these variable okay this is the block variable you can just insert here but before that you have to specify as a flip-flop mechanism as i mentioned to you in the pre uh, in the earlier of this video explanations you, you can just choose the red one which is indicate that the uh, um, led red color are going to be lights on and then followed by some delay so i'm going to put delay here and then i'm going to choose back my uh, red color led as zero so this one make a mechanism of switching on and then switching off so i'm going to make it as a switching on and off one and zero so same also goes to the another um, color of the led you can just specify over here okay let me speed up a little bit so that you can watch the action straight away okay just put it here and then uh, don't forget to change this one as zero so that's mean one delay off delay on the green one second off the green uh, and then wait for another one all right so this is the last one which is i'm going to choose this one and then followed by the blue and then this blue are going to be coded as zero so that it's have a flip-flop mechanism all right then you can insert all of these variables inside the forever block inside here and then to make much more interesting i'm going to set up my fixed timing so that if i change this timing all the sequence of the time are going to be followed so i make a variable over here and then specify as time and then you can choose the set my variables on the top of your Arduino head and then change your time so this time I'm going to specify as one that's mean uh, one second so each time I change this number it will change also the number inside the uh, timing required for um, delay okay so if I change to one it will uh, remain one second on each of the uh, mechanism on and off after that go to this upload code or you can just copy all of this um, code and then paste inside the Arduino IDE and then you can upload it straight away but in this case I'm just going to upload it straight away from the Pictoblox uh, apps so just upload it and then what you can see after this is actually a blinking effect for one second and after that we are going to make it much more faster uh, we are going to make it uh, blink as uh, much more faster where I'm going to specify as 0 0.5 so if I put here 0 0.5 the blinking are much more faster than the previous one okay so this is the example of the 0 0.5 uh, second blinking effect after being uploaded it can blink much more faster than the previous one or perhaps you can just uh, put another one which is 0 0.2 much more even faster than the previous one that you set it up so it's actually um, a very simple process in uh, making a mechanism of the blinking effect by a flipping uh, flip flip flop mechanism using the three different color led by coding it using a picto blocks okay let us look into the actions of the um, led color okay this is the example where your led is blinking at one second delay red green and blue and then repeat again red green and blue so red green and blue red green and blue so we are going to change it into a much much more faster rate so in this example we are going to change it at 0 0.5 so let's have a look what happened if we change it at 0 0.5 red okay this one is uh, being changed at 0 0.2 i'm so sorry this is 0 0.2 so it's much more faster okay okay hey, that's all for this video guys thank you for watching this video please do like if you think that this video is cool and please do also suggest if you think that our content need to be upgrade or improve or you have some ideas about um, new things or new projects that i should explore and uh, furthermore a special credit goes to S steampedia company who are invented these uh, picto blocks uh, based on the scratch and then uh, until next time, see you again. Bye-bye.